So you've set up the PyPico SDK as it was instructed on the GitHub page, but you're still getting all kinds of errors showing up in your editor for missing headers specifically. Uh, we're going to solve that. So I'm using Vim as an editor here, but this also applies to VS Code, I believe. And, um, well, the first instinct is to make sure that the uh, in the CMake build environment that the export compile commands are on. Now, I'm using CMake. You could just be using build scripts, but surely you can mirror the solution here onto whatever build environment that you're using. So, yeah, I'm getting this... Um, I'm getting these errors over here and my CMake looks uh, just like it does in the just like it does in the instructions for setting up the SDK. I've also got this export compile commands in here. So what's going on? Why am I still getting these errors? So the issue to that is that we're missing a little bit of code which I've got over here. I'm going to copy paste this straight over into uh, back into my CMake down at the bottom. I'm going to save that. Oops. Save that. I'm going to uh, regenerate the CMake and I'm going to reload this file. And the errors are all gone. So, what I've added over here at the bottom uh, are these include directories. So, the PyPico SDK makes use of headers that reside within the uh, ARM cross compiler. And you got to make sure that those, um, that those headers are being seen by the build environment. Uh, otherwise, the export compile commands are not gonna are not gonna register those, and as a result, whatever language server that you're using is gonna show that as an error in the code and missing headers. So, uh, long so TLDR, make sure that the headers from the compiler and the whatever headers from the compiler, uh, most notably the um, standard headers, are being included in the CMake file or your build environment uh, under the include directories. Um, and also make sure that the headers for the Pico SDK specific uh, things like um, the hardware RIQ and PWM I've got over there, uh, those kind of things, those also need to be specifically included. I've got absolute directories in here because I'm lazy and this is a personal project, but uh, you could probably set that up with relative directories as well. But that's the solution to the issue that I couldn't find uh, after a quick search on the internet. So I hope that helps some people. Uh, have a nice day.